We've just finished our first full game of First and Goal as part of our Legendary Tactics Super Bowl celebration. In this video, we're going to share what we liked, what we didn't like, and our overall thoughts on the game. This is Legendary Tactics. All right, so what did you guys think of First and Goal? You know, I really enjoyed it. I thought it was a nice, fun kind of, it's kind of like one of the, it's, it's the, the, you know, kind of guess your opponent's card and it's kind of, it, it's got that kind of, you know, just try, try to, uh, yeah, try to figure out the play, you know, is it run or pass basically? Yes. Well, that's it. That's football though. Right. I mean, that's, yep. yeah. you yep. know, you're yep. trying to counter their, their, in, what play you're anticipating. Mm-hmm. Yeah, like like I was saying earlier at the end of the first video, there I would be nice to, to get a sense of what cards match up well. You know, yes. um, you know which ones kind of give well, some yards, but not a yeah, lot. Ones well, that you like think you a, could study them. Like so, for example, the bomb totally you could. can see a, a bomb against the goal line, short run defense, inside blitz, strong safety, even, and you're right. doing really well. Otherwise. But- now, to You're be fair, though, so Nato, well. the, the 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 bomb will never really happen against the goal line defense because goal line is usually it's never you 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 can't use the bomb within twenty yards. Yeah, that's yeah, good exactly. Point. Yeah. yeah. Although so, I was tempted to use the goal line a couple of times because were of the you? payoff. Yeah, just really? like I think I I think I did use it once, but I was within the ten yard line. Like okay. you were within the ten yard line. Well, you right. know what? Like a goal line against a sweep total counter against yeah, a right. draw total counter. Actually, it's really good against yeah, any F- run play. FB strong, right? So, any running play, goal line is pretty solid if you compare yeah. it, right? And because so, you were running so many uh, run plays there, Cax, I thought I was, oh, you I know, was trying to and you run out of cards yeah. after a while, right? You're like, okay, I'll just play this goal line. Yeah. Yeah. I, and because you're only cycling through one card at a time, if you play right. all your running plays, then you're sometimes left with pretty much all passing plays. So you got, yeah. so yeah, I noticed I that, that on the defensive end, I noticed that I was accumulating all these goal line, like goal line plays. Yeah. And uh, there was another one that I was getting a lot of too, <laughs> something about short run defense. Yes. Yeah. And I, and I kept having like mittfuls of these short run defense. And, and, and I, and I knew that I, I had a very good feeling James was going to pass it, but I had yeah. the passing real, like good passing yeah. defense. <laughs> Wish I had known that. <laughs> so, yeah, 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 exactly. But, so uh, what did you like best about the game? Let's start with you, James. Um, I think, I, I mean, this this game felt faster to me. Yeah. Yeah. Although it probably wasn't. It's was probably the probably the same length. It was. Um, it was this. It's. I think all of our videos are roughly the same length. Okay. I mean, certainly component hours. wise. I, I mean, I know we're playing virtual components, but the components here are nice and you know it's colorful and it was easy to figure out. Yeah, uh, it, to get a sense of what what my plays would would come up with because because I knew what die I would be able to to roll. Yes. You know, mm-hmm. I like that. The I'm, color I'm, I'm coordinating com- of the die. That's yeah, right. Those yeah, games. I'm comparing that to the to the other games. Yes. Um, I like the simplicity of it. You know, yeah. like I think somebody could could get into this game. Somebody who doesn't know football well. Mm-hmm. Your your plays are they're there's they're limited plays. I don't mean that in a bad sense. But it's not like you, there's no exotic place. It's all no, no. Yeah, and actually, I draw no and you get a sense plays, of it. right? Yeah, yeah that's yeah. right. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, and yeah. I like how they would how they would say like you know passing play or me you know. Yeah, that's they would right. Indicate so it was easy for a newer player to understand what sort of play yeah they were, I, they were running. I could I could see playing this with a even with a, my kids. Yeah, you know oh, who, sure. who know football oh, yeah, yeah. but maybe not know some of the you know crazy plays that the other the other games did well did a good job in bringing in you know uh the other thing i like about it very symmetrical now this could yes. be a good thing and a bad thing but i mean the teams are equal uh, yes that's the game we play what was the game we played last year what and was I'm it again all bound yeah i mean the teams were and i this may sound like whining but the teams were really really unequal <laughs> we're, we're but that's good balanced yeah, yeah yeah they're unbalanced yeah. i mean and that's fine because sometimes you're like oh i really want to see what this team does against this team yes. you know knowing that one team's stronger and in this case you, you don't get that although i wonder yes. if there would be a way anyways i'm already thinking of expansions what could we do to this? <laughs> you know, bring team and i think there might be expand. well football I can't remember. strategy it's been a which we played in in the, first the initial year. one right yeah that one you it was generic teams, but you could choose That's true. different charts if you wanted a more passing or That's running right. kind of team. Player. Yeah, that's totally right. I'd have to go back and check, but I think they even had a more defensive style team, so you could pick 
So yeah, that's were, right. You could yeah. pick your flavor. So you could pick your flavor. Yeah. Yeah. So so one thing I really enjoyed about this game was the die rolling tension. Yes. I felt yeah, I good. felt that like you know especially when you roll the T and then you have to roll the the, the different die like and when you're <laughs> rolling like you feel that weight. <laughs> yeah, that's true. And that is I true. really kind of like that. I thought yeah. that was like it was like you know like your stomach's kind of shorty like please don't roll. Please yeah. don't roll. Don't <laughs> yeah. roll. <laughs> you know and you're right it was exciting to, when you you know when you you pick the right play as on the offense and you're like oh yeah I get the you know I get yeah. the green and the blue and the yellow. Yeah. That's yeah, pretty, yeah, yeah. There was actually yeah, a bit of like almost like endorphin rushes there, right? Totally like, yeah. right about that. You're <laughs> so, absolutely right. That's so excellent. This and really actually it's very true to life that. because sometimes there's just a big pile up and you don't know who ended up with the ball, right? So <laughs> yeah, that's rolling right. the dice okay. to see who yeah. got it. Yeah. So yeah. Yeah. So, what I else think, did you I, like, Pax? I well, I think that I think that really the, the, the game really caught the 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 essence of football there with the, with that. Yeah. Um the uh the board is fine i i i think that was it worked fine the cards the cards work well i think i do like the idea of different cards and and all the different kind of pairings that james was talking about earlier yeah so you, you, there was a fair bit of variety but i think i could definitely see expansions where that where maybe the plays expand out and your know, potential for that right so yeah um yeah. And the game is, it's very simplistic. And, and that's just great for like very, like for entry level players and gamers. Yeah. I think, I think that's a real, like, it could be a strength to the game. So yeah. yeah. How, about, how about you, Nato? What, what, what did you find? I mean, you were um, kind of the observer. Yeah. I, I think it, it just flows really well. I, I love the, um, yeah, the, I think the die rolling really makes it shine. What I liked about the die rolling was not only how it gives you kind of a nice random amount of yardage depending on the the play because obviously you're really excited when you're roll when you, as soon as you see a green or a blue die in the mix and you're less excited totally. if the red or the beige or that ah, that'll be okay right um but the, i thought the play die i was a bit nervous that the play die was going to affect things poorly because if you if you think about it um there's um if i'm looking at the die right here it has um it has the the hail mary, which is two of the uh, things. There's a breakaway. Uh, there's the X, and there's the uh, the T and the penalty. So it's a one in six chance, basically, for uh, the play to be uh, broken up. One in six chance, essentially, almost for a turnover. Although um, it ended up being because uh, you roll the other die. Um, it's like one in it's, twelve, isn't it? Yeah, one in twelve. Yeah, you got like. Uh, yeah, well, you yeah, it's basically you need to roll snake eyes or whatever to have a turnover, um, yeah. essentially. Um, or um, 36, actually, anyways, doesn't matter. Yeah, it's two, yeah, it's three percent chance, <laughs> yeah, or so. Um, but yeah, the penalties, like, so it was interesting because I felt like in some ways there weren't enough penalties in a way, and yeah. there weren't enough um breakaways, but maybe that's just the game we played. Uh, but uh, I've, the number of turnover turnovers felt about right and because yep. we had three turnovers in our in the game yep and that felt yeah. about right but yeah but it just in terms of penalties um i, yep. I don't I, you're right I think see more of them in, in a game but maybe you don't want that in a in a game like this it's just simple you want them i, I think there i think there could without. have been more penalties actually to be honest because like yeah. one penalty in the whole game is it's pretty that's pretty thin Yes, you're you're usually going to get more than one call in a whole game. So yeah, I, yeah. I'm wondering if maybe an eight sided die would have solved that, or a ten or a d ten would have solved that. Yeah, maybe have, something. You have, yeah, you have more penalty potential coming up, and and then some way of like the penalty happening more with more frequency. I, I think that would have added a, a neat element of like. Uh, I need I need twist a little more of a twist of the game, a little than more it, realism to yeah, it. I but... think it was, I think it was understated in this game. Yeah, and... but the, I mean, as a design, though, I think it's it captures the flavor of football really well. Mm -hmm. Like it, you, you definitely feel like you're playing football, even if there's ah, that's right. You know, a few things around the edges. There's still penalties. There's still breakaways, yep. and that's there's still point. hail marys and all that stuff as well. Um, but uh, um, and we, you know, there's uh, the the time. It was interesting. This is the first football game I've ever seen without a two minute warning. Um, but that's yeah. fine. It was it it didn't really suffer, and I I kind of like the timeout mechanic in a way. Um, but what what else? Uh, what did what didn't you like, or what would you like to improve if you could? Yeah. Well, well I think well, what I, I mentioned before. Go ahead. Or, 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 go ahead, James. Go ahead. Well, I was just going to say I, I we did mention this before it, where it it's it's very symmetrical. So it's um, you know, it didn't feel like I was playing the 
like I was, I was the 49ers, you know, cause I couldn't pull out certain plays yeah. or, you know, we weren't a pass heavy team or a, yes. um, or a run heavy team or whatever else. So, you know, I, uh, the, the game felt, I don't know if it's lighter, but maybe I was thinking about that. I'm like, I was playing the game. Like I was thinking, Oh, I really like this game. Then I started thinking, well, I like the other games too. Cause it's just, is it just football yeah. games that I like? And there's part, <laughs> there's part of that, but yeah, well, I think I still love it. But yep. uh, I, the generic part of it, or the, the generic is not the right word. The the fact that the yeah, generic is the right word. We're just kind of playing generic teams. Yes. So be nice to see yeah. an extra flavor there. And the, you know, you could do you could do it with different teams, but what you do, essentially do is have customized decks per yeah. team. Yeah. So that if would... one team is, has more passing plays, you throw in you skew the deck that way or whatever. If you're a more defensive team, like a run running or pass prevent team yeah. or whatever, then you skew that way. And, um, and I did zero research into this game before we played. And now it's, it's been on my wish list for a long time and I'm pretty sure it's out of print, but I don't know whether there's expansions for it or not. Did anyone see? I, I haven't seen anything. I no, seen I mean, own. they did roll, uh, they did the roll, first, and yeah, roll, first and roll. Yeah. Which might be, that would uh, be fun to play. Yes. Yeah. That's just pure dice rolling. So what about you, Cax? What uh, didn't you um, like? Yeah, well, you've got me thinking about this whole team idea, and I, I kind of, I, because I, I, I'm looking at the symmetry of the game. And it's just, it's almost, it's pretty linear. Like it's pretty linear as it is now as we played yeah. uh, uh, this game. Yeah. Um, and so adding in that team deck option would would potentially be a really neat way to like for replayability. I just, I feel like the linear play maybe it just gets, it just turns into like you know that that. That's a good point. Game. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Replayability. Like, I'd have to think about that. Like after yeah. a while, like, are you just like, okay, you know, yeah, yeah I, I, I'm getting tired of just guessing run or pass on you all game. Right? That's right. Yeah. Yeah. And that's um, a good point for me. And this is because I was observing it more than playing it. But for me, I thought it was, it's kind of a, again, just, it's a simple game and you can't really take it, mm. you know, beyond mm. that. But uh, having just a hand of eight cards, you could have four goal line cards in hand. You could have, like if you have no timeouts, you got four goal line cards in hand, you know, two, two pass prevent and one, you know, F, whatever, like, That's you know right. what I mean? Like, so yeah. it's weird to have a game where your play <laughs> choice is limited. <laughs> yeah, that that's right. true. Yeah, you that's very unrealistic. Choose, but to, well, like, yeah. in theory, if you burn through your timeouts and you had a, a bad draw, you could have like. Guess I guess I'm calling goal line because <laughs> yeah, that's all I yeah, got. You, <laughs> you, know, you could absolutely, even though, even though I'm, you know, the, my opponent's on his twenty, I'm gonna have to call goal line because yeah. I've yeah. got no choice. You know, right? <laughs> right, that's, right yeah, right. that's absolutely true. It, it has a weird thing as the time ticks down, and it's kind of interesting because the plays narrow, but at the same time, it doesn't seem very realistic. Yeah. Know? Sense. I, I I do appreciate they mitigate that a little, or try to mitigate that with the with the timeouts. Yes, um, and I do like I I really appreciate the 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 mechanic of of having the 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 dwindling decks be the timer. Yes, that you know? is really smart. Yeah, That's like clever. I found I found last the the last two games we played, it was difficult for me, you know, <laughs> to know what where where we were in the game. Time wise, yes. mm -hmm. you know, and yes. to play the clock. Where at this time, you know, we're, as we're coming up to the half, I'm like, I'm burning running plays. Yeah, yeah. Just because I'm thinking, <laughs> oh, I'm going to make a big play here, and I don't yes. want to give Axe a time, a chance to get back. To come back. Yes. And of course, yeah. I got burned, but yeah. But <laughs> still, I I did play that. Now maybe it was just me not understanding the other games well enough and not having it in front of me. But I I felt I was playing the clock here a little bit more. Yeah, fo that football was, that strategy. Was really good. Yeah, football strategy had a. Uh, where you tick the you you each that's right, the you move the, move the second, thing right yeah. yeah 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 that's right um yeah. no mm. I, I agree with you on that one too james i really like that the, the deck was the timer that's neat that's, that's yeah. yeah i kept going back and looking at how many cards were left yeah. you know seeing where we were yeah very um, clever and, and i really appreciate all the little nuance they added into this game as far as like taking a knee uh yeah doing doing a qb sneak on fourth and inches right yeah um, yeah all those little things that they kind of worked like it, it's it's you're not missing any parts of the of a football game of a you know of a, an yeah. NFL football game so that's yeah in this game and I, I think that's really cool i think that's that's something to be commendable commended about yeah. and i was i was thinking well at, at the end of the game uh where i would use this and uh and um being an Argos fan as I am, and we go down to a, a fair bit of games and we'll tailgate down there. I could 
I could see breaking this out, you know, on a table under a, a shelter and playing this with people kind of, you know, I, it, because, because there's that dice rolling element, you know, yeah. you could, you yeah. could get into it and it plays. I mean, it does say two hours long and how long did we take? I it was two it hours. Took, took yeah, about it two hours. Okay. Just short. It felt faster to me. Yeah. I think it would be you a know. lot quicker in person too. I think digitally slows it down a little bit. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I feel yeah. like you, could... you, you would once you've got your drive going and you have all your cards there and you you be I would I would boom, I had boom, my boom. cards often ordered and it was just like yeah I knew what I was going like right yeah, so it would be yeah relatively yeah. quick but it'd be over an hour for sure yeah it would oh, yeah. be yeah it'd be interesting to see how roll the roll and um or first and roll would play yes yeah and see if they, they were able to play. translate that effectively uh, over i'm looking well, for the maybe, ideal tailgate game you maybe, know, yeah. maybe first the role has to maybe first the role has to happen in 2025 <laughs> yes yeah. maybe that, that could be 2025 i'm like oh, that feels like the future it is the future know, but... it is the future <laughs> <laughs> it's so funny because i am kind of running out of football games so oh um, yeah sure it, on tabletop there is the old 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 stratomatic uh right. football stratomatic one which was yeah. almost this this year's, but then uh, Flash found uh, first and goal, and you know what? We may have to go. We may have to go absolute um, uh, video and just do like Madden two thousand and one or something. Yeah, <laughs> well, yes. techno ball or something. <laughs> oh, <laughs> techno ball! That would be amazing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, that would be fun. I, my favorite part of techno ball is how if he's way ahead, you just run the other way. <laughs> And it wraps around and the yeah. spray comes out of nowhere, comes out of the end zone. To That's a legit play. On one. Legit. Yeah. <laughs> That's great. And also the 49ers have, um, uh, Mon- uh, sorry, who is it? Montana? It was no, Montana. Montana. Yeah, 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 Joe Montana. And his like, and he, he had a receiver that's just killer. Jerry just, Rice. Yeah, Jerry, Jerry Rice. Rice. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. And just like every time, every time. Or every Bo time. Jackson is, is on it. Oh, Jackson uh, for the Raiders. Yeah. Yes. The Raiders. Yes. And he's super fast. Just, oh, yeah. like, it's so that, great. That would be fun. Absolutely. Yeah. That'd be great. We'll Let's see if we can if we can track that down we'll for multiplayer. That That's awesome. <laughs> yeah. That's I mean, th- this begs the question too. Is it, there's a? T- I mean, football is like the board game of sports. It but it, you know, because well, all the strategy and stuff, and I, I think that's why people keep trying to to make it a board game. But I mean, it can, you can only go so far. Yeah, you know, yeah. there's, like, there's so there's many really, challenges there, and there's not that many games uh, out there. Really, uh, in all honesty, it's it's surprising how few games about yeah. football there are, or even sports in general. There's a, there's a few. There is another game that I would actually love to try with you guys called um, uh, um, Status Pro Football. Yeah, mm. okay. The really it's, heavy duty. It's a heavy mm. duty game. Yeah. You have the real players and it and it's detailed enough that like if your running back ran for a big play, if you put him in the next play, if you don't give him take him oh, off he's the to rest. Yeah. He, really, eh? He, yeah, like it's it's fairly detailed. It would be interesting to try though because that would be it's, fun. it's statistically it's supposed to be really accurate and it has a lot of like you got to cycle your players because they get tired and you got to rest them even just for a play or two, bring them back on there. They've caught their breath. You know, it's like there's, there's some really neat uh, kind of ideas in there that kind of make it it's, but it's much more detailed. That's why I haven't brought it to this, uh, to this Super Bowl. No, it makes yeah, make yeah. sense. It'd be too involved, but Hey guys, I got a question for you. I, I've just been yeah. chewing on this as we've been talking, <laughs> like this whole game is all D sixes. And I mentioned it earlier as far yeah. as like the penalty dice, but what would you guys think if this game incorporated like D tens or D twelves or D sixteens? I don't know if there's a D sixteen, but you know what I'm saying? Sure like, there what is. If, yeah. what, is it, oh yeah. <laughs> yeah okay, no, no. <laughs> what if we, what if, what if the game ramped it up? So like, I mean, you were actually getting like, you know, a lot more specific in yardage. Yeah. And yeah. Why sp- not? Like specific and you know what? I think that's what the the defense die does. It kind of it it subtracts one or three or five yards, you know. So it kind of that's yeah. why you get the, you know a lot of uh, uh, it's kind of accurate in this in the way it it ends up. But what what I like about in like and this was when we were playing uh, votes for women the other day is is what I like about uh, when you add in an eight sided die is you could still roll a one, you could still roll a six, but it gives seven and eight as now a possibility in right. the mix. Yeah. So yeah, I don't know. I, it'd be interesting. I'm 
to see. I think that they've, um, but overall, like the plays didn't feel weird. They didn't feel like they were uh, no that's inaccurate. True. Yeah. So I did. You that's know, true. I didn't so maybe maybe D six is just fine. Yeah, yeah. I think they meant they did just fine with the D sixes. And again, they can um, with the defensive die adds a little bit of a of a spin to it. Um, so you never really know how you know how far you're going to get. I think one house rule then that I would put in is that if you roll the penalty, there's no re-roll. There's no penalty check. It happens. And then you yes. roll to see who it's against. Oh, yeah, I see what you're saying. And that's it. Yeah. So, yeah. So when the penalty, if the penalty comes up, then boom, yeah. it, you just roll to see who, who gets the penalty. Right. Yeah. That's yeah. yeah that's a good idea. I, I think that would be a neater. I think that would be a neat house rule. Yeah. Yeah. And that's, yeah. And that's very easily implemented and it would yeah. make it more accurate in that sense. So that's good. So overall verdict. Uh, I'd play it again. Yeah. I'd play it again too. Yeah. yeah. I give this, uh, you know, lighter than the other ones, but still lots of fun. Yeah, that's, right. that's right. Yeah. And no, Nato, right. would you, would you, would you want to, would you dabble with it? Yeah. Oh, absolutely. I was, I, I think it's a, a really fun and accessible football game. No, no question. Any, exactly. any suggestions I have are more or less quibbles. I think for what it is, it plays yeah, that's right. really well. And, uh, I like how accessible it is. It's something that, you know, again, if you've got someone who's interested in football but not that interested, I think it's uh, this game can, uh, yeah, it's a great yeah. introduction that might get them scratch that itch, to right? The, yeah, to the real sport, yeah, for sure, for sure. All right, well, thumbs up, awesome. Yeah, thanks awesome. so much yes. for watching our review. And this uh, has we'll been <laughs> Legendary Tactics. <laughs>